I go by Lufisto. My nickname is the Wounded Al, but in the past I've been Lucifer, Precious Lucy. <laughs> Precious Lucy was actually given to me by the Mountie. He changed my name uh, on a show without telling me. I just opened up a newspaper and I was like, oh, that, I guess that's me. <laughs> Most of the stuff I did, I did by myself, whether it's my my, my t-shirts or my, yeah. I designed my own website. I'm, I'm actually a graphic and multimedia designer. So I, I control a lot of things, like even my DVDs. Um, first thing I do is I email the promoters, like, can I have this match? Do you mind if I I use it on my DVDs, like, no, you can use it. And then I create the stuff myself, which, oh, I was watching it. I was playing uh, in a band and my drummer was like, you got to see this guy. He buries people. <laughs> he was talking about The Undertaker. So I started watching because of him, because I was like so impressed with the whole thing, the way he wrestled, the way the way he knew this character and that he was building caskets. But through him, that's when I discovered Medusa versus Volnacano. And I'm like, wow, they can go. That's different because I had seen women's wrestling before, but it was more of the typical women, you know, hair pulling and stuff. But then they were doing suplexes on the head and Bull was jumping from the top rope. And my God, Medusa's Germany, like this big woman. And I'm like, wow, this is impressive. And through that, uh, back then it was tape trading. <laughs> right now we have everything on YouTube. But we would, um, my friend would order VHS from collectors or whatever. And I discovered Japanese wrestling. Akira's arm's almost broken. And then they get into a fight that is not pretty. And then it becomes bloody. But I was like, wow, what is that? <laughs> and yeah, I think from that moment, that's when I'm like, I want to be a wrestler, but I want to be like them. I want to show that women can be as vicious and violent and different and better than the guys.